Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and in this one I'm going to be speculating more about Assassin's Creed, like the future of the franchise, etc. Hope you like my character's outfit, I have been working on it for like months now. Um, no, I haven't, uh, I'm joking. But anyway, let's get into the speculation. This isn't just about the um, victory, which is the upcoming game, this is about the future of the franchise, and so on. So you guys will expect to hear some interesting shiz that I am thinking right now. All of it is made up, of course, it's no facts, this is all my opinion, my my thoughts, what I want, the speculation ideas, it's just all purely speculation and all of it, and at the moment you should take everything I say with a grain of salt as to being in the final game or one of the future games. So anyway, let's get into it after that 40 second introduction, make it 45. So, okay, um, next, let's start with victory, okay. In victory, I want to have an optimization on my PC that actually works, a decent, decent quality, I want, like, like, Graphics like Unity's, a better story, it needs a great story, and it needs to be, it needs to have, like, it's, it's London, it needs to be littered with easter eggs from that time, like Jack the Ripper and etc, because the murder mysteries in this, apply that to London in the late 19th century, which is going to be in the, it is the last half of the 19th century, at least, because the Tower of Westminster, which everyone mistakes for the Big Ben in full, Big Ben is the name of the bell, but it is there, that is there, that was built in, 1850 something, so 1856 I think. So it's definitely the last half of the 19th century, which means it won't be Arno or anyone. So that means we might see Jack the Ripper, which would be pretty damn awesome actually. I'm pretty stoked on seeing that. That would be pretty cool. Guys, just back me up here. That would be pretty damn awesome. I've said pretty about 26 times in this video. Hope nobody minds. But anyway, yeah, that that's just my thoughts. And victory, it needs to have a good story and everything, like I said before. But, now we're going to move on from that, because otherwise I'll be starting to be a douche about that, because, you know, I've been a douche too much tonight. But, anyway, we're going to move on from victory. I haven't said much about it. Comment down below what you want in Assassin's Creed victory. I will not judge any of you for your jage. But anyway, we're going to move on to the rest of the franchise. Now, in the, for the end of the franchise, I want a very good ending, which every fan is satisfied with, no matter what they want in the ending. I want it to have alternate endings, maybe, for the franchise. That would be pretty awesome, pretty slick, pretty top keck. But other than that, I think that they're going to pull off a, de a decent ending, or maybe they might just do a Mass Effect. I hope they do a good ending and not a Mass Effect ending, because a Mass Effect ending would suck penis. And if they did it, I would kill them forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. But, besides from that, I would be pretty interested in seeing what they do. Um, settings I'd like to see in the future are Egypt, Ancient Rome, um, Japanese setting, we need a Jap like Feudal Japan, Maybe the American Civil War, I don't know, that might be a bit too future, that is he? But they're going to the like, late 19th century now, so that shouldn't be too future, is 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 There's not enough buildings to climb it as, which would be pretty damn annoying, innit? But other than that, I don't really know much else to say, but I'm going to say this. I want some Willet. No, I don't, I don't want some Willet. Uh, you didn't hear that. <laughs> I'm joking, of course. But I'm, I'm, I'm not homosexual before I get all the gay comments. I'm not. I'm not. Uh, I'm not or anything. That I'm I'm, I'm straight. I'm straight as a roundabout. No, I'm no, I'm straight. Just moving on. Before I say something, that I'm gonna regret later on. Um, coming up to the end of the video now. We're in about a minute or so. But I would like to say, in so they need to stop cocking up with the optimization on PC because we can't abide by this stupidity. Even Assassin's Creed Three and Assassin's Creed Four had the flaws that were notable, and it just got really annoying and really stupid. And it's just going to lose fans for Ubisoft, and that's something nobody wants. Not even we want. We want to see a better Ubisoft like they were back in the day when they were helping make they helped make Morrowind and etc. Not like they are now, where they're just you know this is what this is the product. We get crashy games that don't work, and we get etc. But so we want a good optimization, a great story. We need a great story. We need we need an interesting story. We need interesting characters, character development. Maybe return of Desmond or something. I don't know. Maybe not. I just want a, a story that we can all get into and etc. Which will be pretty slick, pretty awesome, pretty keck. But other than that, we're coming to the end of the video. Please comment down below your thoughts, ideas, and etc. I will of course. I'll take them in and maybe talk about them in future videos, which I did before. And I got over a thousand views. That's quite successful. So I'm gonna do that again in the future. So you guys will be able to find me. Like subscribe if you want to. Please thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, share, comment. If you enjoy this video, please share it with your friends, and maybe they'll enjoy it too. If you enjoy my channel, please share my channel with your friends as well. That would be pretty awesome. And 
I will also love you forever. I will love if if you subscribe. I will love you forever. Not because I want something from you. I just like I I, I, just, I will just like you for doing it. It is pretty brilliant. It'll be brilliant of you. Brilliant of thee. Avast to thee. But thanks for watching, guys. See ya.